Okay, everyone, we're going to go over a defense to the Ezekiel choke from the mount position. I've played around with a lot of different defenses, and uh, it's a tight choke. It's really difficult to deal with. But there are a few ways out. The one that I like the most is the one I'm going to share with you guys now. Um, I'm going to mount position here. Once, and we'll show a different, couple different angles here, when he gets a hold of my neck, and then he's already in. This is after he's already on the choke. Okay? Things are pretty bad at this point. You've only got a few seconds to deal with it. So the first thing I need to do is I need to bump forward to drive him up this direction. And then this arm on the same side of the arm that's coming on top of your neck, I need to shoot that arm through. But I've got a bridge to be able to do that. I can't get my arm through here like this. It's too tight. He's going to be settling in on you. So I want to bump to take his weight forward and I drive that arm through. I shoot it through and now I'm going to walk. As I keep my pressure on that elbow, I walk all my weight to this side and then I bridge to take him over. So I'm stuck in the choke. This hand is going to come underneath. I'm on a bridge. You can use the other hand even under the armpit on this side to help bump him forward. It makes it a little bit more difficult when I bump him up to finish the choke. If he stays right above me and straightens his arm, it's a done deal. Okay? So I want to bridge. I drive forward and this arm's going to shoot through the hole. Now, once that arm is through, I'm going to start walking and bringing my elbow to my ribs. All my weight is over here. My hips stay up and engaged. Now, if I've got to get rid of any hook I can find in the middle, keep the foot trapped and then continue to bridge him over. So give the defense a try and let us know what you think.